everyone, my name is Allison Cook and I am a clinical imaging specialist with GE Healthcare. Today we're going to be talking about collimation, what it is and how to use it. Collimation is a beam restriction tool so that your image quality is better over your area of interest as well as it reduces your scatter radiation. First step before you even use the collimation tools is we want to make sure that our image is centered. This is a lateral lumbar spine. We are centered within our field of view and you'll see this dead space or blank air. By using two collimation tools, we can remove this and have better image quality. We have two collimation tools for you to choose from, dual leaf collimators or iris collimators, otherwise known as linear collimation or circular collimation. You can find these on our touch control tablet right at the bottom here. On the left hand side, you have your circle or iris collimation, and the right you have your dual leaf collimators or your linear collimation. To engage these, I'll start with linear collimation, you will hold down the button and you will see the preview lines appear on your screen. Then you would take a new picture, and we can see that our collimators are engaged, but unfortunately they're not over our area of interest. At the very top here, you have a rotation function that will actually rotate your linear collimation over your area of interest. Once you rotate, we'll get that nice and centered up, open that up a hair, and take our new picture, and there you have it. Now let's say we wanted to use our iris collimation. You can use both at the same time. To engage that circle or iris collimator, you hold down in the middle here, until we're right around our field of view. Once we take our new picture, you're good to go. Now let's say you wanted to see the entirety of the field of view. You would remove your collimators by holding down. And then of course taking a new picture to showcase your entire field. A couple of cases where we really see the benefits of utilizing collimation primarily surround around lateral spine imaging. Of course, here with the lumbar spine, it's great to remove the air. We can also utilize our iris collimation when we're imaging C7. That way you're removing the areas of lesser density so that you have better image quality. And again, utilizing your collimators reduces scatter radiation. Those are the basics for collimation. Thanks for tuning in.